Halo guys, what's up? Welcome back again. Nah, sekarang kita lanjut ya ke destinasi selanjutnya. Satu kilo. Apa ini? Ini break. Oh, lari lah bro. Oh, bisa naik ke atas. Kita kasih tanda berarti. Bajunya keren ya. Bisa otomatis ngebuka sendiri gitu. Di bagian hoodie-nya. Kalau naruh tangga ke sini bisa nggak? Lebih bisa gitu coba. Oh nggak bisa bro, kepanjangan. Unstable surface. Bisa gitu? Di sini ada step slope. Apa itu? No way. Apa itu? Oh, ada mall di sini. itu less non position kita ya. Oh itu dia tuh orangnya. Ngikutin kita gitu. Ya udah lawan aja lah. Ya, yeah. muncul lagi masalah satu nih. Rain mana rain? Time fall. Pitches kemungkinan ya. ada tempat sembunyi kita kasih tanda di sini apa namanya ya jump
And yeah, hide in the grass. Tapi uh, gue nggak tahu ya apakah sign-sign ini bisa dilihat sama player lain apa enggak nggak tahu juga sih tadi sempat kepikiran soalnya karena seharusnya kalau emang bisa dilihat sama player lain daerah sini tuh udah banyak banget tanda gitu loh kan game ini udah lama gitu kan. Apa ya? Oh itu. Tadi tuh tem apa namanya detektornya si Mule. Oh, Nargen. Kita kasih tanda aja deh di sini ada Mule. Hati-hati nih. Tuh, terus di sini caution. River and slow down. Kalau slow down maka tetap bisa dilewatin tapi mesti hati-hati. This way. Go up. Clear. Dia, dia di bawah ya kasih tanda di sini step slow Selama masih kuning, it's fine. Tapi stamina kita berkurang.
Aduh, apa lagi nih? Kok oh, ada situ ya? Aduh, ada si Beats lagi. Caution and Beats. Merkan. Jadi si Odre Ode Drag ini nggak bisa nge-scan Witis ya. Dia tuh jauh situ. Meskipun disconnected, kita masih bisa lihat dia. We got company. We got company. Si anteng dia di situ, di depan juga ada, di situ juga ada. lagi dia ada tuh situ ya wait 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 sini di mana nih sepertinya sini aman aman kan juga ada arah jam satu waktu di episode pertama kita hampir aja tuh kan kena tangkep sama bitis nggak tahu tuh bakal gimana kalau ketangkep tapi gladly si Sam ini nggak bisa mati oke okay. si odedrak nya ini ngedipnya agak lama itu artinya bitisnya jauh. Oh, nice. Apa nih? Something wrong, Sam? Oh no, it doesn't look so hot. Uh, nothing to worry about. Its functions are temporarily suspended, but they can be restored. I can perform the necessary maintenance at a distribution center. Hurry though. Hmm. Auto toxemia. Oh. Oke, okay, tadi gue juga ingat banget kalau si bibinya ini kena auto toxe apa tadi toxemia ya. Dia nggak akan bisa ngelihat si bitis gitu loh. So kita harus ngapain ya sekarang? Bibinya coba cek kan bibi. Nggak bisa sih.
and the body, in essence, begins to attack itself. It's called autotoxemia. Auto, auto, toxemia. Drop by your private room and see if the incubator helps. Okay, basically, kita harus pasang si Bibi ini ke inkubator ya. Karena bibinya stres. Oh, ada motor nih. Motor kita kan rusak tuh. Bukan rusak sih. Jatuh ke jurang. Sampai juga kita di Distro Center West of Capital Not City. Kasih dong S bintang 5 sangat ramah tepat waktu ya enggak Tanggi banget sih ini emang kayak berasa ada gitu loh teknologinya. Dead man, you there? Little help. Okay, Sam. 
Remove the pod and connect it to that incubator. It's in. Good. Uh, a temporary excess of stress. Easily addressed if we return it to its mother's womb. Mother? Located in the capital not city ICU. Brain dead, of course. Ah, uh, you mean still mother? Correct. A still mother's womb facilitates a connection between the world of the dead and the BB. And you, in turn, connect yourself to a BB, granting you the ability to sense BTs. <sighs> These pods were designed to simulate the conditions inside a still mother's womb. BBs need to believe they're in one at all times to function properly. However, we can only maintain this deception for so long, which is why we must periodically update the environmental data by synchronizing it with a steel mother via the chiral network. There. The update is in progress. Right now, the pod is synchronizing with the Steel Mother in Capital Knot City and reconfiguring its settings based on the latest data. Returning your BB to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress levels. That being where it technically belongs, of course. Kid looks happy. I'll try adjusting the oxytocin dosage. Autotoxemia should set in much slower from now on. <sighs> uh, you should remember that BBs are just equipment. Try not to get attached. Each one has been physically removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable and prone to failure. No BB on record has remained in service for over a year. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. And then? You're saying there's no way to keep my BB alive? Uh, you must understand. There is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. As we expand the chiral network and recover more past data, perhaps we'll find our answers. Uh, oh, right. You asked me to look into why the BTs might be reacting to your blood. I spoke with Hartman. We should have your results soon. Anyway, get some rest. You and your BB are both exhausted. <sighs> Good night, Sam. Kita benar di clueless gitu. Nggak, hingga dibikin apa ya maksudnya dibikin bingung <laughs> oke okay, I think it's kenapa ya Sam kalau tidur tuh harus diborgol gitu loh kenapa ya ada apa gitu memang kalau nggak diborgol This is Anne. How are things over there? Still not under guard. Still not chained up. Still can't leave. But if you can keep making connections, if you can get to me, we can go back east, back home. Siapa sih Emily ini? Thank you. I mean that. Dia ni diculik gitu kan? It's bad. There are fewer and fewer people in the cities these days. No one's having children anymore. 
But humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together, to help one another. And if we as a people can't do that, if we can't reconnect, then, well, it's like Bridget said, extinction. Mm. Come on. Rebuilding America isn't going to get rid of the BTs. As long as they're still around, there's no escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. I'll be waiting, Sam. On the beach. Waiting for you. Come and find me. Okay. Hello, Sam. This is Hartman. Since you're awake, it might behoove you to freshen up. To that end, why not take a shower? Ya, kita kan habis kehujanan tadi. And also my research as it happens. So we can use toilet, sitting. <laughs> Bunyinya bunyi motor Harley. <laughs> Kenapa nggak sekalian mandi aja sih? Harus keluar dulu. London Bridge is falling down, falling down. orang Inggris nih British bahasa aksennya si Hartman Opportunity arise, try using it on a BT. I'm curious to see how they react. Who knows? It may even prove beneficial to you. There was an old research paper detailing the effects of bodily fluids from individuals like us on BTs. It is only by recovering these materials that we can unearth the knowledge of the past. Not just the death stranding but also the mystery of your body's unique properties and even our doom's affliction. There may well be hope for humanity. Sam, I have no interest in rebuilding America. I want to recover the past. Five, oh, four, it's almost three, time. Two, one. After you make your connections and nothing happens, then what? I said, then what? Kenapa tadi tuh? Ada hitung mundur. Oke, okay, forget it. Sam. Sorry to bother you while you're taking a break, but I figured you'd want to hear this. Oh, maybe it'll help you rest easier. We received a number of messages addressed to you. And I've not taken a look myself. Hmm. But I gather they're mostly from your clients. You should see if they contain any useful information. Mail can be accessed via your cufflinks as well as the terminal in your private room. There's something else I'd like to share with you. With the Cairo network, we now have the power to reclaim our past. Data once thought lost forever from every corner of America can be pieced back together from fragmented records. Our archives are still a work in progress, of course. But as we expand the network and integrate more way stations and cities, 
we'll be able to recover more and more information, such as the previous expedition's logs and reports. Everything they sent back was lost when Central Knot City was destroyed. Now, we've managed to restore some already, in fact. You can access them from a private room terminal or your cufflinks by selecting Archives. Might make for interesting reading. Okay, kita baca email dulu dari Benjamin Hancock. Sorry, Sam. Bad news. Thanks for delivering those rare medals, Sam. Everyone at the Distro Center really appreciate you coming through for us. Jempol lagi. I'm afraid I've got some bad news for you, though. That bike you saw outside, it's very dead. You will have to give it some juice if you want to use it. Only need to do it once, though. All the chargers should kick in after. Sorry if we got your hopes up, and uh, I've got some more bad news for you, too. What do? You see? Different facilities have to work together, sharing materials so everyone gets what they need. And to make sure that everything that is produced gets put to proper use. That's why guys like you are so important. Without porters, the whole system falls apart, whole world even. Anyway, there is this guy. Church Baton, Baton or siapalah, over at the way station. He used to be a re reliable porter, but lately it's like pulling teeth getting him to make even the simplest delivery. Keep speeching about being scared or not having enough oxy or whatever. Always some excuse. Even when he does agree to make a run, he is liable to lose half his load and route. So yeah, that's why we are a bit short on material, mat materials at the moment. I'm sure you will soon help us put that to rights. We'll count on you, Sam. Ya intinya sih, dia yang mengatir kita sama ngasih tahu kalau motor di depan itu bisa kita pakai asal kita isi itu kita charger. So ini dia George Patton yang tadi nih dibilang banyak alasan dia nih kalau kerja. <laughs> Gak separuh-separuh lah ibaratnya. Sam, my man, our savior. Bla bla bla, oke. Okay. Ini juga sama buat nyemangatin. Bibi masih itu ya, istirahat. Sam, we've received a distress call from the distro center staff. Check the order on the delivery terminal as soon as you're ready. Ada order ya? Tidak ada. Minum dulu kali ya. Minum dulu, minum. Oh, Bibi anak dia. Sister woman in the mask was done nothing. 
nothing but lie to me. Sam, there's something I forgot to tell you. It's about managing your BB stress levels and reducing the risk of autotoxemic attacks. I need you, How? There are a few things you can do if your BB starts showing signs of distress. Such as? Such as take a moment to look after it. Cradle the pot, gently rock it, that sort of thing. Out of curiosity, how's it doing at the moment? Uh, before I answer that... Something wrong? When I hook up my BB, I see things. What kind of things? Like a face, someone I don't know, calling to me. There's this room, too, with other people talking, but I can't make out the words. Mm, lead through effect. Didn't I warn you about this? You're mistaking the BB's memories for your own. They're false flashbacks, nothing more. Let me explain. A BB is harvested from its steel mother at around 28 weeks and placed in a pod. To be clear, this is before it's even born. The procedure halts its development. But even at 28 weeks, its sensory systems have matured enough to process external stimuli. It is more than capable of encoding this information into memories, which can bleed into yours via your connection. So who's the man I saw? Someone from the medical team, maybe? Or a BB technician? Does it matter? The BB has been in circulation for a while now. It's been handled by a lot of people. How should I know which one made an impression? Because you're the expert. No one's an expert, Sam. BBs were developed decades ago in secret. They're your quintessential black boxes. We may use them, but we don't truly understand them. Believe me, I've been trying to learn more, but almost all of the old records are gone. If I find anything out, I'll tell you, all right? Dead man's honor. Timang, timang. <laughs> Lucu bener bagi bibi ini. Oke okay lah kalau kita. Gitu. Sam, check the delivery terminal and review the list of orders. While you're arresting, I ran some network diagnostics. Corellium monitoring and holographic systems are nominal. Unfortunately, our printer is offline. I know, I know, after all the trouble you went through to bring us those materials. This one's on us. We ordered a part a while back, but it never arrived. The printer needs it to communicate with the chiral network. Mules must have snatched it, caught that porter en route or something. If I'm right, they'll have taken it to their drop site which is smack dab in the middle of their territory. Don't suppose you'd be up for stealing us our property back? Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Hmm. Take on orders. Ada dua, recovery chiral printer interface. Ini my mission, yeah. Ini collection chiral Crystal, any side mission? Mama's added a watchtower schematic to your PCC. Mama, if you don't have it on you, consider fabric. Never know when you'll need to recon an area. Carry on the back. PCC again. Mm, carry on the back. PCC laggy. Test the suit. Okay. It's all fine. That thing you're holding is a crystal collector. Now, as the name suggests, it 
provide secure storage for any crystals you gather. Uh, 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 allow me to describe your quarry. Chiral crystals appear gold to the naked eye and have frequently found in formations resembling human handprints. The surrounding rocks and debris tend to float a few feet above the ground. And they are most commonly found in areas with high precipitation. Got all that? Hmm? Rain, floating rocks, golden handprints. That's your trifecta. Look for these three things and you'll find the crystals. If you've been especially observant, then perhaps you already know where to look. Oke okay guys, uh, sampai di sini dulu video kita kali ini. Uh, kedepannya semoga kita bisa nyelesain Death Stranding sampai benar-benar petualangan terakhir ya, karena gue juga sangat-sangat penasaran nih sama petualangan si Sam nih. Karena ada banyak misteri yang belum terjawab jelas karena ini masih awal-awal game. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Gue Gray and sign off. Bye bye.